greetings, Marcy here. Um, I just want to take a moment to open this uh, Pelican Twist. Um, this was one of the items that came in my recent uh, Jet Pens order. And I was so busy with all the other pens and the inks and everything, I put this aside and didn't get to it. Anyway, um, I do want you to know that it, of course, is rose gold because I love that color. Um, it is a medium nib and it has a special triangular shape to keep it from rolling and it is good for left or right-handed writers. It does come with two black cartridges but I ordered an additional, um, see I'm trying to see if it says this, the color. I know it's pink but I don't know if it has a special color like, oh it just says pink. Okay, no fuchsia, no special specialty names. But um, real quick, I want to open this and show you the contents included. I'm trying to find the best place to open it. It's gonna be right here. So in the back, there's a lot of information that's in several, several languages. Um, I know I ordered this from Jet Pens, but I believe Goulet Pens has them, and I did see them on the Chalet Pens um, website. So, if you'd like to look at those, put my cartridges aside for later use. And We'll open it up and see what we have inside the package, inside the body. I don't know that it has um, a cartridge installed or it didn't say it came with a converter. Um, the nib style is kind of modern and flat. Let's see if I can get you close up there. No special styling or design. Um, I guess the, the special design is all in the body. And since I opened this uncapped, I'm going to cap it to see what it looks like. And the design is, it's called Twist. Um, so it won't like roll around and roll off your table. Um, it's supposed to be a, a comfort grip. We'll test that out and see how, how we like it. It does have uh, the Pelican symbol on the top. Am I getting in focus? So it, it can't be a twist, it's just a snap cap. Seems a little um, difficult to like pry apart there. It takes quite a grip. Um, the Pelican insignia is on the side. So, and it does post. Um, the shape of the pen, even with the twist, does allow it to post. Kind of quite large. So let's get in here. I'm assuming this doesn't unscrew because of the shape. Okay, y'all are experiencing this with me. This is I can cannot dismantle that here. I'm going to attempt here on the nib unit. Okay, okay, it does twist here. There is a screw, even though it has a twist ergonomic design, it does screw. Um, the body barrel is empty, and this is ready to receive a cartridge. There's nothing in there except for the, I know it's dark in there, you can't see. Um, but as I struggled with taking that apart, I did look at the, packaging and it says that it is a young modern design ergonomic grip grip zone for right and left handers refillable with pelican ink cartridges um, blue ink can be erased and ridden over with pelican ink eradicators now i don't have pelican ink eradicators um, i've never heard of pelican ink eradicators but we'll check into that and it does specify blue ink so i'm assuming the cartridges that came with um, can be erased with the eradicators. I don't know about the pinks, but 
pink is going to be what goes inside. And we'll just have to investigate that and find out. So, um, I will store my blues, my unused blue cartridges in the box with um, the pink. So, I won't forget which pen they go to in my storage. Because I have several other brands of cartridges. So, if you'll notice, this is the end that the ink comes from and it should pop there we go I just opened that end and I will screw on the bottom we'll let um, the feed moisten with the ink I'll prop it down for a quick minute while I try to get these um, cartridges stored in here since I took out one, I'm assuming two won't fit, but they will. Okay, so I have my Pelican Pink that I bought, and I'm storing my two extra blues. I am going to investigate that um, Eradicator. Uh, I've never heard of that. Um, while I'm waiting for my feeder to come down to the nib, I'll get my Stology. Um, this is the same Stology I wrote with the other day when I tried to share my new Twisby stub nib. So here we go. Yeah, that cap, of course, being tight is a good thing, but I'm just not used to it not being round and simple. I guess the, the most simple round caps I have, snap cap, are the Lamy because they just pop on and off. And then my Twisbees are all um, twist caps. So this one seems a little challenging to get into. And that may be a, a good thing in some instances. I'm still thinking of that instance. But I'm trying to see how long it's going to take for this ink from the cartridge to get down into the feed. So give me a minute. Okay, so I did allow... Um, the feed to absorb some ink so we're going to go here with some vertical lines it does make quite of a, a broad line this is a medium nib some horizontal lines there's quite a bit of feedback and um, pulling at the end of the stroke mm. um, consistent lines seem to be fine but when you stop there you go uh, this is the Pelican Twist, and these are the extra pink cartridges that I purchased just to have fun with. Um, the package did say the blue was erasable. Um, and with the Eradicator. I don't know. We'll have to check into that. Anyway, you can find this. I purchased at jetpens.com. Um, Chalet Pens, or Pen Chalet had it, and I believe um, Goulet Pens had that in the rose gold twist. There are many colors. Um, you just have to check the websites to see if the color you like happens to be in stock. Thanks for joining me. Have a blessed day. Bye-bye.